have 55 mil to burn, I guess. 31 at the airport, 32 downtown. It's a beautiful start to the day. I want to show you the wind. It's out of the south at only seven miles per hour. And after the intense wind we've experienced this week, and the elevated fire danger, it's nice to finally get a break. Not only for Denver and the Front Range, the entire state of Colorado, the whole region will have less wind today. So great news for opening day. First pitch temperature, 2 10 p.m., 63 degrees by the ninth inning, 66 under mostly sunny skies. Again, just a great day for baseball. Today will be about 5 degrees warmer than normal for the eighth day of April and opening day since the Rockies started at Coors Field in 1995 has been trending warmer. In fact, uh, recent opening days overall have been three degrees warmer than they used to be. But of course, some years is very different. 2018, it was only in the 20s at first pitch and it snowed, if you remember that. So the storm system to the east of us uh, was uh, influencing our weather with all the wind. It's now moved far enough away that it's lost its grip on our weather. High pressure over Vegas is going to make its way toward Colorado today. And it's tomorrow. We're going to tap into some of that warm air. They'll be in the 90s down there. We'll be in the 70s here tomorrow. And then the cold front rolls through tomorrow night and Sunday will be noticeably cooler. Most of the snow with that system stays north of us in Wyoming. Temperatures today, 60s around Denver, Boulder and Fort Collins. Tomorrow, 70s around Denver, Boulder and Fort Collins. Some 80s showing up on the eastern plains for tomorrow. With that warm weather does come high fire danger again. And unfortunately, from 11 a.m. until 8 p.m. tomorrow, we have a fire weather watch for virtually the entire I-25 corridor in Colorado. That will likely turn into a red flag warning for tomorrow. And then there's that cooler weather on Sunday. We'll get a few mountain snow showers on Sunday, McKenzie, but down here we should stay dry. Maybe a rain or snow shower in town on Monday. Better chance for wind and rain on Tuesday and wind and snow on Wednesday. First alert weather days possible both Tuesday and Wednesday.